Oh, there's my laptop. I was just wrapping up. Oh, you guys are still here. Welcome back, RC enthusiasts. I see you're a little anxious to learn a little bit more about Spectrum. Today, I am going to give you a video on how to update a few of our different transmitters, such as like we have here the DX5C. This also includes the DXE, which is a transmitter that's for aircraft, and the DX5 Rugged. The Rugged, that's an awesome radio. It is a, a uh, another surface radio like the DX5C. Essentially any radio that has a program port on the back, such as the 5C, it has a little hatch door here that you can plug in a program cable. The program cable that we're talking about, and we'll mention it again, is the SPMA3065. So let's say that you already own a DX5C, and you're like, well, I'm happy with my DX5C. I really don't know why I need to update it. Well, here's a good reason. You might wanna use Spectrum Smart ESCs. Updating your DX5C, your DX5 Rugged, will allow you to see Spectrum Smart data on your Spectrum radio. Awesome stuff. So you'll get a couple extra telemetry screens and features along with that. So if you want to use your Spectrum Smart Firma ESC with your DX5C, follow along with this upgrade video. Okay, we're down here at the bench with my computer and a DX5C, and we're gonna go ahead and update that, and I'm gonna walk you guys through that. This will apply for the DX5C, the DX5 Rugged, and the DXE. So if you guys even have that DXE aircraft radio, this same instructions will help you get through that. So let's go ahead and crack open my laptop and I'll show you what you need to do. Okay, so the first thing that you need to do is download or open the Spectrum PC programmer. An easy place to find that is to simply search for SPMA3065, our USB cable. So I'll just search for that on Google, SPMA3065. And if you go to it on Horizon Hobby or on Spectrum, which we'll go to it on Spectrum, you'll have a button for PC download here. We'll click on that. And then we'll go down to the most recent version here, right here. Um, yours might be different from that. Just depends on where you're at in the space time continuum. Okay, I've already got it installed, the latest version, so I'm just gonna open it up. And then once you've got the Spectrum PC programmer, installed and open on your computer, we're going to go to the top left corner and log in. If you're already logged in, if you've used it before, it'll automatically log you in, but we're gonna go ahead and kick, oh, click log in, and you'll notice it says create an account or log in. So if you haven't had a, created an account, you can create one here, and it'll create you an account on the Spectrum Community website, or you can log in like I am right here. All right, I'm logged in as Tom. All right, next up is to plug in the Spectrum USB programmer cable, the SPMA3065. I'm gonna plug it into a open USB port. Your computer's gonna go doot doo loo because it's plugged in a new device or you've plugged in a device. If it is a new device, if it's the first time that you've ever plugged this in, you'll get a little pop-up saying that drivers are installing. Just let it do its thing. Next step is to plug in the servo end of the USB programmer into your radio. So we're using a DX5C here. This also applies, like I said, to a DXE and a DX5 Rugged. Pretty much anything that has a little port on the inside or a little slot, uh, slot on the back for a USB programmer port. We're gonna take the lightest colored wire, which is the signal wire, and plug it into the top pin. If you plug it in backwards, it's not gonna hurt anything. It just won't work. Next step is to turn on your radio. Once you turn it on, you'll see that it has this little loading bar here. It's on the update screen. All right, once we've turned it on again, it will show our serial number, the current version, and if there's an update available. We're gonna choose install another version. The version you're going to install is gonna be the latest version. I've actually, I'm on the beta team here, so I've got a beta one here but we're gonna install 1.06, hit update, and it's gonna update. You'll have a little loading bar on your screen, as well as the loading bar on your radio will start moving. Um, if it's the DXE, you won't see a loading bar on the radio, obviously, because there's no screen, but it will be, I believe it's gonna be flashing on the little orange indicator. So just wait for it to get done on the screen, and you're good to go. All right, and we're done. 
And that's just how easy it is to update your Spectrum radio with the USB programmer. This doesn't apply for models that have a SD card chip that you can plug into it for updating or for the IX models because those update over Wi-Fi and there are other videos for that. So if you're looking for something like that, go ahead and search for them on our YouTube channel. Awesome. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any other questions or comments, please leave them below or you can message us directly on Facebook. Please like and subscribe for more Spectrum how-tos, promotional videos, and just more Spectrum fun. Again, thanks and happy flying and get smart, everybody.